In this video for Easy Cut Studio, we're going to be demonstrating how you can create uh, this sort of effect here, which is the punched out text uh, just from a font that you do have. And for this, of course, you do need to have uh, your text. For this, I chose, uh, you know, if we take a look over here, I chose Impact. Again, just to make things simple, uh, with the text selected, all you really have to do is select all the text and go up to Effects, and then we're going to go up to the Shadow Layer and Contour. Now you're going to see it puts a puts a small frame around there, but uh, on this example that I showed, I used an inset shadow, and if we take a look at it, it's going to start on the outside and work its way in as far as the shadow goes. So, you know, as you can see, I can do this and it's increasing the shadow inside the letters. But we only want one layer count. And for this, of course, you can use the slider if you want, or you can simply type in a value. And for this, I'm just going to choose, uh, you know, 0.1. And then I'm going to go ahead and click over here so I can see what the effect is. And let's go ahead and change this color here to, to something else just so that we can see it. Maybe we'll make that a black. All right. So uh, there we go. We have our text. And let's just go ahead and click OK. And with this still selected, so we can get the punched out effect like here, uh, it's a tool up on the object menu and it's called Merge. And Merge will just simply merge the paths together. So uh, we'll select it and go to Object Merge. And then that's where the punched out effect comes into play. So uh, very simple to do this uh, within EasyCut Studio.